This conference will now be recorded.
Good evening guys, I'm Audible. I hope that I'm Audible. Uh, today we'll talk about Instagram ads like Instagram marketing then how to create Instagram ads uh, for the new digital marketers like uh, the first time those who are going to create ads in the Instagram. Most of the same steps which are going to be applicable for Instagrams whatever we have done for yesterday's like yesterday we conducted Facebook ads the same uh, face in the Facebook ad itself we can create Instagram <coughs> Instagram ads there is no much more changes but some of the concept you have to understand <coughs> like uh, why so popular Instagram Instagram is uh, popular in the social platform where people are going to share the photos and videos and it has uh, evolved into the powerful advertisement uh, advertising the platform for especially for business to reach their target audience with the billions over a billions of active users in Instagram offers a vast potential audience for your business with uh, as you connected for the Instagram okay when you open Instagram just uh, I'll try to showing you open Instagram and your login ID is enough just to click login I'm taking this to So just it is an in, uh, example uh, where what and all menus you have in the left hand side like home search explore real message and uh, notifications and create from this create option we can have post and reels but you might be asking sir where we can create uh, ads or not so uh, from here onwards we we don't have any options for creating just it is an uh, working space of our uh, Instagram if you wanted to create any ads then you have to come here ads business uh, business dot Facebook dot com or ads manager yesterday what you have seen as ads manager dot Facebook dot com but before we get into the ads creation first try to understand what about that Instagram's uh, advertising platforms <clears throat> as I told you there is a billions of active users okay I wanted to see that number of active users for Instagram Instagram active
users. Could you able to see this? 2.4 billion active users in the Instagram. This is based represent approximately so one fourth of the world active in the internet uh, users on each month and Instagram approach it's around uh, 13th anniversary in the 2024 <clears throat> but uh, we talk about the next concept like uh, what is exactly the imp importance of the Instagram ads for the digital marketing so when you put an Instagram ads play it's a crucial role in the digital marketing strategies we have to use some of the strategies for to run your business ads and to showcase their product and services highly engage their audience with the precise target options and businesses can also ensure that ads reach in the right people and leading and also to increase the brand awareness web, web website traffic and also even the sales also when we talk uh, when we talk about one by one one by one so what are the guidelines we have in the instagram policies and guidelines that also an important when we work for instagram we have to understand the standard aims and also be safe respectful and also enjoyable environment for all the users what platform is created and policies uh, in the instagram's various aspects like uh, content behavior and interactions in the one platform everything will be included in this area community uh, guidelines it is to be important like authenticity in the instagram when you whenever you start working for this so guidelines outline guideline outlines acceptable behavior and also the content standard for all the users authenticity then safety privacy intellectual property and also content standards if uh, one of the rule if guidelines if not applicable then your Instagram maybe not uh, account will not be working properly <clears throat> so here I'll be writing this uh, policies and guidelines It is a community guidelines in the community community guidelines the number one authenticity authenticity is nothing but the user should be genuine and also authentic in their interactions and content genuine and also authentic in their interactions and content number two going to be a safety user should always refrain from their threatening and also harassing and also promoting violence against their against others user should refrain from threatening harassing or promoting violence against others then it's a violence or the guidelines is going to be applicable and next thing is the third one is privacy so in the privacy user should uh, respect others privacy and also refrain from their sharing personal information without uh, consent user should uh, respect others privacies and refrain from sharing personal information 
without <coughs> consent so the fourth one we have intellectual property so in the intellectual property user should respect intellectual property rights and also avoid infringing on copyrights or, or any other trademarks so be careful whenever you copy or copy something and all user should respect that intellectual property property rights and also avoid infringing on copyrights or trademarks next the fifth one we have content standards so the content standards it defines user should uh, refrain from the posting content that is hateful then discriminatory then sexuality then explicitly and also violent so these are the things which are going to be applicable for community guidelines then after that you have one more called as okay i'll be writing here the last one before i going for content policies user should refrain from posting content that is hateful discriminatory explicitly explicit or violent these are all applicable these are the guidelines and rules for community guidelines the next we have a content policies in the content policies the policies uh, regarding the different types of contents that are allowed and also prohibited in their platform so that includes that rules like uh, any nudity content if they post then obviously instagram prohibits that explicit nudity and also that particular content including that uh, uh, what i can say that uh, acts okay nudity acts whichever is there that and all it comes in that content policies then violence <clears throat> violence and uh, graphic content so number one in this what i am writing nudity content not to be posted and second thing is violence and also graphics content so the graphic content instagram prohibits the content like uh, the promoting violence then self harms and harms to other uh, harms to others then uh, disturbing the content may also be the restricted in this case then the third one this will be like hate speech if people are talking speech and also harassment instagram prohibits that hate speech then um, harassment and also discriminatory as i as i mentioned in the uh, beginning then based on the other factors such as like race then religion gender then uh, uh, disability and uh, what i can say other uh, protected characteristics 
okay so these are the things which are applicable in this content policies then next the third one is belongs to safety and well-being safety and uh, well-being this is also applicable instagram always measures the place to promote your uh, user safety and also well-being that includes the tools for reporting and also blocking abusive uh, abusive and also harmful content such as uh, as well as that uh, resources for supporting that mental health and also being uh, well-being so the next we have data use and also the privacy the data use and privacy instagram has a policy governing that uh, governing the co collections use and also sharing uh, some of the requirements in that includes that uh, requirements for obtaining the contents for data processing providing the transfer transparent informations about uh, data uh, practices and also uh, comply compiling with the uh, relevant uh, privacy law and uh, uh, regulations this and all comes under data use and also the privacy next we have uh, advertising policies this advertising policies guidelines regulate that content con uh, content creations the creations and also promotions of the ads in the platform in the ads platform this includes that rules and also related to the prohibited content accuracy and transparency responsible for targeting intellectual property the data you say use and privacy and also prohibited prohibited privacy uh, advertising practices so these are all the uh, guidelines which is given by instagram next if i wanted to set up a instagram ad manager you, you must have one business account as i told you uh, already if you have a facebook account it's enough then if you link to your page to your Instagram then obviously it start working in this uh, area clear that we will see when you creating the ads account okay when you if you wanted to accessing that Instagram ads to uh, ads to your uh, Facebook account so you, you have to visit uh, like ads manager in that ads manager uh, uh, you can select that into link option so whenever you create an ads which will option for you to place your advertisements is it to be in the facebook or instagram so as you selected the placement then automatically it start working on that then next <clears throat> one minute
people are asking why I supposed to go for Instagram why I supposed to choose Instagram uh, Instagram placement uh, for advertisement the answer is number one Instagram generates uh, 120 times more that engagement per follower than your Twitter and also the Facebook so nowadays Instagram is a powerful platform for creating the visual content for any kind of your uh, business activities so th this is the reason the question is why should I go for Instagram ads Instagram is a powerful platform for creating visual content for your business. Then Instagram generates 120 times more engagement per follower than Twitter. Then next Instagram makes it easy to share visual content to your visual contents to your uh, other marketing channels channels the next one Instagram makes make it easy to discover new photo and also new people and also new businesses you can search via people hashtag or also places Insta make it easy to discover new photos then new people and also new businesses you can search via people hashtag or places the next important thing is Instagram is going to install the Instagram app on your Android and also iOS smartphone <clears throat> this is also one of the re reason and next we have there will be a tab sign up then enter your email id what how I have shown you now address and also tap next then you will be getting interfaces then create a username whatever username you like for beginners you can take okay and also password enter password and fill out your profile information and then tap done 
so this is how you have to get started your Instagram getting started with Instagram account then follow this steps so everybody knows about this suppose if I wanted to have some proof hack proof tips then I'll be giving some of the hack proof tips so number one create two Gmail email address similar to your social media handle like username clear do not go for only one account you must have a two account for your business people will ask you sir why supposed to have a two mails two emails answer is the first is to register your social media account and not tell anyone about clear next the second you are going to list in your social media account account bio about us for people to reach to reach at uh, to reach you at advertising partnership or general questions next important thing is never use email you use to register your social media account as your contact email ID as it increases your vulnerability to hackers clear this is the main reason you have to use two mail ID if people are hacking your account and uh, they will be destroying your data if that increases okay then increases your vulnerabilities uh, to the hackers then finally you use the second one the first one what you have what I've done clear
so here we have some Instagram account profile so you can modify your uh, you can change your profile you can edit and also you can uh, upload any other photos you can choose from the library which is having 180 into 180 pixel size and upload your photo and that that can be shared that can share uh, the particular uh, photo as a post okay the people who are uh, going to following you the people can see that okay and also save that uh, login information as as you wanted to have then if you wanted to allow the people when they are coming uh, finding you and also people if they allow you to follow and you can allow them or you can uh, set that not now so that depends upon you so that you select now the important thing is system is going to asking you to do something so if I click here and you have some options like apps and website okay so make use of this option for your business and enter all your informations what whatever you have like uh, informations which are belongs to uh, personal things or uh, what I can say website informations so if that activated it, it actually what I'm showing you it is a personal account so in this personal account uh, I'm not using any uh, business related things but as you created any informations that is going to take from your meta account center is that okay so just you come back so from that area this is going to creating and you have one more option called as add tool so in this add tool just you click here and could you able to see here manage your ads so when you create an ads you will be able to manage from here itself okay so here you have create a new your uh, new post or new ads it's a smaller one but over here here we don't have any uh, campaign like this okay so you can boost the content of your profile whichever is so popular if you wanted to boost how, how you have done in the Facebook the similar similar method here also you can boost your post again you come back but if you select it here and system is asking which one you would like to post it so go to the reels mode but here I don't have any reels so I'm going to select one of this one of this and if I click next then system asking you to pay money this is the preview ad then visit your profile yes or if you would like to visit the website so select and asking for the website information call to action button like contact us whichever you want I'll be taking so techmentor.com and scroll down and select contact us okay just you click save then would you like to have uh, special requirements if you want you can say that okay social issues uh, elections and so that and all we not required and now the next question is when do you want to see your ads so suggest suggestion uh, suggested audience you can select from which date to which date you want for example so this is already has taken so start with the new one audience name okay gender okay you can specify but uh, in this case I have selected all because we wanted to have all set of categories for joining the course or something like uh, something and and also I can specify the age limits also let's so let it be 18 to 50 and you go for and uh, next you have a locations if you wanted to specify each one of this area if you type Bangalore and select it okay then if that okay come back then next you go to the next option interested
so students so international students are uh, student exchange program I'm going to select only the student category in that you have uh, higher education than uh, college students so whichever you want that you select in this filter the details okay so then you click save the two things is done then age is also I have specified then finally click save the moment if you click save and also close this in the left hand side everything is updated now and you can see here one minute yeah it is done I wanted to go for this one so specify the audience names digital right now that estimated size we'll see later so come to this area your budget so daily uh, you have to spend around 500 rupees then this is your estimated reach if you wanted to increase and select and also you can decrease which of this you want and set the duration per day six time or you can increase if I want ten times then see this the budget so over uh, 5050 uh, for 10 days and there's a maximum reach and per day you will be spending 505 rupees okay for seven days this is this is the estimation so you check out as you want if you don't want set duration then you go for until run your ads until it until I pause it so you, you select this one and start boosting clear when you click the button boost then immediately which will asking you to make payment and whatever uh, the content uh, disclaimer uh, this one rules and regulations which I've taught you and whichever given so see uh, if that uh, rules if violated then which will be not going to be uh, displaying so see to that are you created in such a manner uh, discriminatory ads or something and all then they never promote they will be pro prohibited and if if you say that I accept then it's ready to go there but still I did not set this payment so if you wanted to set the payment go to the payment part then if you publish then immediately it start working is it clear how to boost your Facebook reels photo whichever you want in Facebook whichever is most popular one so we have so we have a, a video like a reels especially reels when you click here if you select any one of the photo one example I'm going to take just selected have a look once
so just it is an example you how you have to create the content so the content which I've created by using AI tool and uh, I have downloaded so one of the kind uh, one of the video or one of the real uh, what I'm sharing now so I selected this to original and you can go for the next if that everything is okay and also you can mute if you don't like the sound okay but nobody likes that so you make that on and go to next then write the caption okay and accessibility what is alt and would you like to auto generated caption so let it be and scroll down again in the advanced settings would you like to hide the likes and also view the counts on this post so I don't want to hide I want it to be unhide and turn off the commenting so I don't want to turn off the comment if you wanted to turn off the comment for this video or reels then just you can go for this but I am not suggesting this and if everything is that okay and uh, just you write the thing I'll be writing AI suggestions. AI suggests and click share now. So once it is uploaded, close this and go to your home page. But it's not. Yeah. So here we have a just now what I've posted. If you want to select the reel just you click the real button so post and uh, the whatever uh, we have uploaded which will show you in the post and as well as in the reels if you have saved anything then which will show you okay and also you can set that new collection what you want but uh, right now I am not going to do that okay so just simply I have uploaded this and you can see what is the number of views here itself okay and see this the people uh, like this this people also uh, means this photo liked by 10 people 14 like this you have some list and also analytics just if you click then start playing so from here you can boost the reel okay if uh, again to uh, what I can say expand your uh, number of uh, audience in the same video or same reel just boost the reel or boost the uh, photo or image whatever I've explained in the previous one everything is there then finally start boost the reel you follow that what is required what is not required clear and again come back if you not like this this is how boosting the video or reels And you can see what is the inside of this. How many people liked so and so on. Still is not placed. It will take some time to reach the audience. Then from there, from, from the personal profile, it start published. Then people will give the responses based on that.
guys have a five minutes of uh, break then we'll continue the remaining things
So welcome back guys. So this is a simple method how we can create this and also from here on we can boost the account uh, real. So this almost is done. Now if I go profile.
a student you have this option professional account how how do you, uh, how will you get very simple go to more option in the more go to in the settings in the right hand side down you have a professional account so click the professional account okay if you wanted to create any brand retailer or any businesses then you, you must use this professional account so in Facebook how you have a business page here is here also we have a professional account for businesses but it's taking time suppose in your mobile phone if you have that uh, option you click and try uh, try that So this is our professional account like category which is selected as advertising advertising and uh, marketing so select this display category uh, category label and this is our mail ID and set up your mobile whatsapp number if that connected then next you go for your mobile number and would you like to take the calls or text whichever manner you want that you select and you click submit button then your account will become a nar uh, what is that uh, business profile account means a professional account then is that okay if you wanted to change the category click and select like you have so many categories options are there but i'm not going to change any anything here so let it be this same one this is how you, you can select suppose for your understanding purpose if you wanted to change I'm going to select product and click done this is changed and finally I'm getting this option uh, to submit but I'm not going to take that like marketer marketing so here we have advertising and marketing just if if you type that keywords then immediately which will give you some list in that you select whichever you want and finally you take the call for submit but most important thing is if you if you are logged into your Facebook app or from your mobile phone okay then your Facebook page that you are going to be an admin uh, yeah so admin for the particular page for business and also you can choose the link Facebook page and also Instagram account whenever the uh, option is updated if you have professional Instagram account you you now uh, you can create ads custom audience product catalog Instagram shopping and also view analytics and much more how can you get this in the business tools could you see this what is this personal and creator account so I wanted to have a creator so switch back so you will get professional tools could you see this so creator controls and also switch back to uh, business account and again switch back and you can change it so like this 
you can change this option understood and also you can set the account privacy but now the question is yesterday we created one account like uh, ads In this ad campaign we created that name is called as winter collection okay now if I click this winter collection edit button in the bottom I will show you second one men winter collection so still is updating so scroll down specify the budget and schedule selected only Instagram the ads will play only for the so from the ads manager dot Facebook dot com using this URL we can create a campaign only for uh, wait for a wait for a while then once it's uh, display then I will show you Go to the ads. So scroll down, scroll down again. Uh, place Instagram account I can edit here the same one could you here Instagram stories Instagram one side you have Instagram feed and Facebook feed the next parameter is
I'm not getting quick response. Suppose if you don't like, so stop this active mode, turn off this active mode and click the more button and delete this. When you delete, then campaign will get deleted. Just it's a simple example how to delete campaign. Saying that it is a pub publish draft items so right now earlier status what uh, was uh, active now checking here the status it's become off again if you wanted to make active then what you do so open this and look at this what is saying this active if you wanted to stop this click edit and go to option and delete it then next uh, Anything I'm missing here, just uh, wait for a second. I will check and I will tell you. But page is not updated properly, so that's why I'm not getting the option Facebook and Instagram. Between these two, you will be getting that option. In that, if you select the placement of the advertisement, then it start advertise only in the Instagram uh, platform. Then finally click the publish button. You try and you check, uh, you let me know about that, whatever uh, you, uh, you know we have done in the last class in the same manner, but not to select Instagram, directly select only in the uh, Facebook when you are conducting. But at the same time, if you are running this advertisement in the Instagram and as well as Facebook and select both the platform, that audience responses from the responses and also uh, the calls or any details the insight option then you will be getting exact figure so uh, just for time being I'll be closing this and uh, you can have again if you wanted to create one more new campaign creating here digital marketing DM1 then click continue okay I don't want to take and asking for the ad set name okay. so something it is taken Close this first. Create a new ad. 
I have to come out from this. So close this. Because I was in edit, uh, editing mode, so that's why it was displayed. So from, from the same account, here also you can start and you can see the insight. Okay, you try this and you let me know the placement of uh, advertisement. You will be getting Facebook and Instagram. Select Instagram, then which starts advertisement in the Instagram platform. So there is no much more uh, changes in this. So use this meta account, business suit, or ads manager. It. And here also you can boost your uh, reels by paying some XYZ amount. Clear, right? You ask me if you have any doubts. So this is our in Instagram marketing. It works. I can take your uh, request and also queries if you have So create one professional account and uh, upload one reels and you send me that link even I uh, I'm also watching in the whatsapp group so share share that and uh, send me the advertisement screenshot what you created for the Facebook is that fine guys So may I stop the session today? Okay, so we'll meet you in the next class. So see you all.